Hey Fresh fans, Kieran here from Fresh Farm Aquaponics and today we're going to show you how to transplant seedlings uh, using biochar into a rapid or DWC aquaponic system. Um, so over here we've got our seedlings. This is a red sales oak leaf lettuce. They were started in a coir vermiculite mixture. Uh, to transplant it's really simple. Just grab the plants by their base, give them a little light tug. They should come out like that. You can see the nice healthy roots on the outside, a little bit of moist coir on the inside. Um, and then to break them up, you just little, literally just let it crumble in your fingers. The lettuce should pop out pretty easily. You just give it a shake and most of that should come right off. I'll clear it off a little bit more before I put it in. If you have more than one seedling and a, and a thing, you do that for each one. So you want to make sure you get most of it off the roots, get them nice and clean get them looking healthy uh, and then you take your net pot I like to hold it the way I took it out right at the base right above the root tip like that and then you just simply drop it into your net pot like that and then as you can see I use my third finger up there to hold the net pot up while I have the seedling inside from there I hold that over my bucket I use my other hand I grab some biochar Biochar is a form of charcoal. Um, it's very similar to activated carbon, which you may be familiar with like a Brita filter. It's, uh, it's a very porous media and it's a really good home for the microbes um, and the bacteria that are gonna convert our fish waste into the nitrogen we want for our plants. So we take the biochar, we take our seedling in the net pot, we put it in like that. Get it even all nice around, straighten out our seedling. And then that's it. From there, we can literally just plop that directly into our aquaponic system, and we're good to go. That's all we need to do. We planted a plant. No getting our hands dirty. You know, no digging in the soil. Quite easy with aquaponics. Uh, I hope that was informative. Thanks for joining us.